So I got a 2016 uh, Honda Accord. So customer brought this over. This plug, as you can see, this is the wrong plug. You look at all of that. It came with a CAN bus. I love it, but the problem is it's not the right one. So I don't know how. I don't know why. And like I said, this plug will fit on the Android system. But the problem is... If you look at the main plug, I tried to bypass this piece. It didn't work so well. See, you see this plug right there? That's not the right plug. It's too small. It's got to look like that. So what I did, I used one of the aftermarket plug and plug everything, the yellow, the red, the brown, and everything. Everything working right here, you can see. But now what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be installing the, uh, I'm going to bypass the uh, stick. Uh, I'm going to hardwire the steering wheel so the steering wheel will work. I'm going to I'm going to attempt to do the backup camera using the factory piece. I don't know if it will work or not, but I will try. But so here I'm going to go. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to tap this black wire to the number 11 right here. That's 11 12 13 14. Whoop. Not sure that's 11. The brown, I'll check that. Oh, I'm installing the uh, uh, I'm not installing, I'm hooking up hardwired the thing, uh, the uh, steering wheel control. As you can see, I cut the uh, key two. I'm gonna use key one, I'm gonna hook it up to the pink wire. The pink wire is right on the bottom of the brown. You can see on the bottom, the brown is pink, and next to the pink is the light green. And then you want to hook up the brown wire. The brown wire is going to be the ground. You have to hook it up to the ground for the steering wheel to work. And then now I'm going to program it. Uh, I'm going to see if I can uh, get the uh, backup camera to work. But most likely I'm not sure. So I got everything hooked up. And I'm going to show you how to program it by clicking this menu button on the bottom. And go to, you know, it's going to be on this screen. You want to move it to the steering wheel key. And then what you want to do, you can press short press or long press. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to press mode. And then I'm going to press mode right here. And then as you can see, it's learned successful. So I'm going to do volume up. And then volume up here. And then vo volume down volume down right there and then i'm gonna move forward which is the uh where is that at next scan scan up scan up click on that le right okay scan down go to left right there and then uh where is the it should have more stuff here but it doesn't have for phone pick up and stuff like that i don't see it uh well i guess i guess that's it that's weird oh never mind it does go up and down right there so now you want to uh pick up the phone so you want to where is the pickup at? Uh, next hang up, hang up, next hang up. Why is it next hang up? Oh, we got so much stuff here. Phone link. I don't see the phone pickup. I just see previous, previous answer. Maybe this is probably, yeah. Okay, answer, press this button. And then answer right here. Hmm, that's not going to work. It doesn't, it doesn't program that part right there. So this is a little bit different. Let me try this. Uh, hang up. Oh, that's hang up. Nope. That doesn't work. I'm looking for something else. I guess that's it. That's the only thing I can program on this one. And some cars a little bit different. Voice. I probably can do voice. Let's click on voice. Nope. All it does is program the other stuff. So I'm going to press save. And then let's see if it works. Yep. Volume's good. And uh, CP link. That's probably linked to Android Auto and all that stuff. So yeah. I don't know. What Apple. I don't see that. I, don't, I think this is for that. But I'm not, I'm not sure. So. And I'm not sure if this is Apple CarPlay or Android. Thing, but I'm, I'm pretty sure Android Auto right there should work. Let me click on that real quick. It should lock to my phone, so. It does. It's work. It just kicked me out for a second. And it does work for... Oh, it's even telling me uh, outside garage door left open. Uh, yes, it does work with my phones. And, uh, yeah. Uh, I'm not sure what kind of phone the customers got, so...